keep your spine straight, close your eyes, take a deep breath in and exhale. Take a deep breath in and exhale. Take a deep breath in, hold it there. Oh. Oh. Om Shri Ganesha Yanamaha, Om Shri Saraswat Yanamaha, Om Shri Guru Pyo Namaha, Samasta Jana Kalyani, Niratam Karuna Mayam, Namami Chin Mayam Devam, Sadgurum Ram Havitvaram, Sadgurum Ram Havitvaram, Yogena Chitta Sepadena Vacham, Malam Shari Rasitavaitya Kena. Yopa karotam pravaram munina patanjalim pranjali rana tosmi Ramaya Rama Bhadraya Rama Chandraya Vedhase Raghunathaya Nathaya Sita ya Pataye Namaha. Pranams to the Lord, pranams to all the Mahatmas in today's class. A very happy Ram Navami to each one of you. So before we get into our homework, checking and regular class, let us uh, offer the Namaskar in form of writing to Lord Rama. So a simple mantra, Shri Ram Jai Ram Jai Jai Ram. How we have to write? I'll show the first one. Now all of you know the alphabets. So it's going to be very easy. And at least 11 times, let us write. Uh, so that would be our beginning of uh, combining the words and writing. So we know how to write Om. Okay, so we start. We know how to write Shr. Sh and R. So we do Shr. This is our Shr. Now we make Shri out of it. So we know E ki matra. Shri. Okay. Shri Ram. R we know how to write. Ra we make A ki matra. Shri Ram. Shri Ram. Jaya Ram. J we know how to write. Ya we know how to write. Shri Ram, Jai Ram. Now we learned how to write Ram. Jaya Jaya Ram. It's all in one line because I'm holding the words alphabets uh, bigger for you all to see. I'm coming in second line, but you all completed in the same line. Shri Ram, Jaya Ram, Jaya Jaya Ram is one line. Jaya. Jaya Ram. And in Sanskrit, we put full stop like this, like one straight line. We don't put a dot. Our full stop is one vertical line. In uh, When we write two verses, a uh, two lined verse, and then the first line will have like this and the second line will have like this too. So that shows end of the verse. So we have either like this and then like this. Okay, so all of you will write it 11 times in your notebook to invoke Lord Ram's grace. And I will also write over here simultaneously. And once you are done, just tell loudly that you have done mute and then you can say. So this is our thing that we are going to write. Hmm?
हरि ओम हरि ओम इट्स हां द नंबर्स आर यू आर राइटिंग द नंबर बट यू ऑल कैन यू ऑल कैन राइट इट इन इंग्लिश नो प्रॉब्लम नंबर्स बिकॉज़ आई हैव नॉट टॉट the uh, numbers i will teach all later but you all can write in english no problem because it's not been taught yet right unless if you all want to learn it now itself then i can tell yeah why not good why not in sanskrit one is written like this i'll write it in black so that it's visible good good question <laughs> okay one is like this one you do one knot and then you come little slanting then two is like how we write in english two but there are two knots okay three is also like what we write in english but we have one knot below three okay so first three are easy now four how you write is you do like this like this sign that's four five you do one c and then you do one knot like this a c and a knot six is a mirror image of three so it's other way six i'll say again six Seven is you do like a U and then you put one knot. You do a U and then it's a knot. Seven. Eight is you start like this and you just do like this. There's no knot, only one sign like this, a slanting line, and this. This is eight. Nine is reverse of one, like this. like this so this is 1 and this is 9 and now 10 we know 1 we know so and then 0 is like 0 wow crash course on numbers on ram navami this is awesome for those who have joined late greetings of ram navami we have to write shri ram jay ram jay jay ram 11 times in the notebook numbers i have written like this and uh, it's easy to follow shri shra with e ke matra r with a ke matra ram jay ram jay jay ram
that you finished writing? Just unmute and let me know you have finished. Varsha ji finished. Hariyo Varsha ji finished. Hariyo. Awesome. Very good. What an auspicious day to have a class on this day. I'm done with the last one squeezed in over there. Done, Shaji. Okay. I had one question regarding Shra. Mm. Yes, ask. You know, the, the shra, in no place is it, or is it belonging to some other dialect in the Indian language where the, sorry, where the, where the sh, uh, shra is not joined, you know, where that, the first alphabet of that shra, I mean, that first part is not joined. Does to, the, it, to the main line? No, joined as in the V, the point, you know, where the, the top part and the bottom part is. The, is no, it, it has to, huh, okay, you mean it is like this. Uh, is it is it somewhere else, some other dialect in Indian language? Or where am I getting that in my head continuously for making that mistake? No, it should it go together. Hindi in the... Or everywhere yeah. it's like this only? It's like this. It's like this only. Okay. 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 Vashaji finished. Okay. So I got about how many people are there? Okay, but Sajjah is finished now. also. Okay, so most of them are four. Five. Finished. Awesome, awesome. Sajjah, well, I've got a question. The music, Shri Ram. Yeah, we have written Shri Rama. So yeah, we... we have to, actually, we have to chant Shri Rama, Jai Rama, Jai Jai Rama. Okay. But we are all saying Shri Ram, but it is Shri Rama. It's not a halantama. Are you on? Done. Done. Okay. All done. Now let's yes. progress into a class with his blessings, with his power. And probably when we will learn how to write conjuncts and all, we will go into more shlokas. Uh, like what I've chanted, Apadama Paharataram, or any of those shlokas, we should know that. But which will come gradually. Today it will be too much. Today we have just learned how to combine the alphabets. So, good start. Now, coming back to the homework aspect, most of you have done nicely, but um, the clarity on um, the and the is not there. So you, some of y'all are starting with the, ta, ti, and then ending with thi, the, the. So y'all are not having the awareness of um, how the has changed into Mahaprana automatically. So that much awareness you will have to maintain in chanting it. Then second I noticed was uh, between the and the. So the sound is not coming. The can come as the, the can come as the also. So the is English T-H-E. So you can put a sign. The third alphabet is T-H-E, the. So you have to maintain that consistency throughout. The, da, di, di, du, du, du. Because by the time you are ending, you are getting into Mahaprana, you are changing that. And the is not a th. So the is a Mahaprana of the. The, when you aspirate, you are going to get the. So that part you will have to remember. This is one aspect hmm, of Alpa Prana, Mahaprana. Then the second, uh, uh, I'm going to erase this now. Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. I don't want to erase it, but what to do? <laughs> I have to erase it. Okay, I'm erasing it. Another part which I noticed was to write ukara. Let's say we have taken the alphabet to. Then to is written like this. And the dirgha is written like this. But what I'm seeing is many doing something small like this over here. And this is going like this. Many are still doing like this. So this is the sign, small u. This is the sign, big U, Raswa and Dirga. This should not get uh, confused like this. This is not correct. So this has to happen. This should turn up. And this should start and then, uh, so it's this side, your left side, it's not right side turn. Hmm. This is one part. Then, any, uh, some of you have written, let's say you all are writing dha. Then when you are doing dhi, you all are doing dhi for it, like this. No, dhi is going to, dha is the sound. For that, you all are doing dhi. So this should be there. This is a sound. For dha, you all have done dha sound. So when you go to the next alphabet, you are not doing e on the sound which is done. You are going back to the original dha plus e is equal to d. This is d plus a. So I, this you will have to keep in mind. So when we did g, I had reminded, but still that error is there. So somehow you will have to fix yourself that it's d plus e. D. So the original on the original alphabet. So this is not correct. This is correct. Then what else I saw? Uh, it came in my mind and I just slipped. This was one, this uh, the other one was. Um, I think it was with Ru. Ru. And Ru. Ah, it was with the pronunciation of this. So, Nr, uh, Sama saying Nr. Or tra. Tra is this. So you cannot say tra. You will have to say tru. There is a slight ukara and rakara. Tru. Tru. Dru. Dru. Nru. And then dirgha will be tru. Tru. Dru. Dru. Nru. Hmm? So this sound you will have to keep in mind. The sound of this was not correct. And then um, um, Ammaha, everybody is getting correct. Oh, ha, yeah, remember. J, J sa, uh, is written like this. So many of y'all have just written on E. This is E, uh, this is, can, this cannot be Jha. So this, this entire is one character. On this, we have to do J, Jha, G. This is uh, the character. So many of you have done on this character. This is a swara. This is a vyanjana. Both are different. This is one entity. This you will have to remember. Hmm. I think I've covered most of it. Yeah, still the pronunciations only. So I think over the practice, it should come. So now everybody clear? Anybody has doubts still so far? All clear? Okay. Now let's go ahead. Uh, we are doing Pavargana. And we will finish the Gunitakshara today. So next we can start with conjuncts, how to make two Vyanjanas join. So we have our A, uh, A. Uh, ah, still some are not sending in the format asked. So it becomes very complicated for me to correct. And, it, and the handwriting will also not be good. 
it will be with some light to this and then double then it's all confusion so when you write in one for you there will be clarity for me i will understand whether you have understood or not but if there is one jumble and one scribbling of the things then it's a very strain for me to identify that hmm? and also when i say put one page it should be in one page so only couple of people have put it in one page ch 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 varga t varga t varga so we uh, reduce the number of postings in the group and number of because on each of that i have to comment so if one person posts three three pages means two pages and one audio file on that my comment is that means we are multiplying so much messages in the group so that's again a nuisance so we should uh, stick to one audio file one page if we stick to that format then there is no strain on anyone else we don't disturb the other group members but i've seen some people posting two two three three photographs of cover acha varga ta varga ta varga that's not expected so see for some who have done that seen the group how they have written on one page everything fits very nicely if you are following the format okay so now let's go ahead a a e e u u r r e i o o m a so the last alphabet in our vargya uh, uh, last varga in our uh, last uh, varga in our yeah, in our vargya vyanjana is p varga we are doing that p so p plus a p very easy p plus a p p plus e p p plus e p p plus u c b careful you put that whole line and on that you do this p p plus u p so like this this is the common mistake which i have seen then p plus r r l plus r r l p plus a p i pai o po au pau am pam aha paha okay now we go for the a vargya vyanjanas y oh sorry i didn't finish we aspirate the p and we get the sound p so always remember there is no f sound in sanskrit it's p sound in sanskrit ph sound and no f sound so it is it's going to be phalam not phalam for any there the p comes it has to be said as h it is there is no f sound so it won't be phala anywhere hmm? so those who are hindi speaking which they easily say f so be very mindful in sanskrit we don't have that sound we have p sound p so when you aspirate p automatically it's p only p because it's a labial so you have to use lips p p so it's aspiration it's a mahaprana of p hence there won't be any other sound okay so p so now listen to the and you all can say in your muted voice loudly and repeat after me p ha yeah. ha p p you can mute yourselves p Ho. Ho. Pr. Pr. P. 
pay. See? Pay is the sound, not fay. Not fay. Closing the lips. Pay. 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 Pull, 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 pull. See the pressure coming out on the lips, on the air, on the chest, and the force. Pull, pum, paha, pum. Ha ha. Ha ha. We go for the next sound. B. This should be easy. Like B sound only it is. So. B. Ba. B. 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 Br, br, be, bai, bo, bau, bam, baha. Now comes that Mahaprana, which many don't get properly. So we'll take time on. So we are saying B. B. Now, B, you have to aspirate. B. B. So it was B is B A. B is B H. Like in Shambho. It's not Shambho. Shambho. Shambhu. Bhumi. Bharat. Bhagavan, Bhagavata. So it's not Bhagavat, Bhagavan, Bhavani. Hmm? So see the difference. So many are not getting that pressure which has to build on the mouth. Like for her, when we said there was such a pressure on the lips and the chest. So like that, same pressure now is going to come to say Bh sound. So we have to maintain that pressure. Hmm? Don't lose the pressure while pronouncing. So, B is the sound. We are going to start. B. You can mute, you can mute and chant, please. B. 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 You should not say B. 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 Maintaining the pressure on the lips and the force of the air coming out. Bru Bru Be Bai Like in Bhairavi Raga B Bai Bho Bow. Bum. Baha. So it is bum baha, not bum baha. So many times that her I'll take later. It's not baha. Baha. Bha. Baha. So please maintain the pressure. Hmm? 
then the anunasik of that varga is ma which should be easy now ma ma me oops me mo mo mr mr me mai mo mau mam maha so bhaj and the ma distinguishing this is that not it cannot merge into each other so this completes our pa varga anyone wants to chant and show raise hands i will okay raise hands okay hamsanandini go ahead okay pa pa ah uh, simple pa don't don't pa. go for pa okay is pa p pa p sound pa pa p p u u r r p pai o pau pam pa ha pa pa pi pi u fu ah you are saying fu it's okay. not fu pu 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 pru pru pe pai pho phau pham pha very good ba ba bi bi bu bu br br be bai bo bau bam ba ha good ba ba bi bi bu bu br br be bai bo bau bam ba ha where a bam bam ba ha say these two again bam ba ha ah now correct okay hmm. ma ma mi mi mu mu mru mru me mai mo mau mam ma ha excellent very Thank well you. done anyone else wants to okay we'll take only one more that is venkatesh ji okay go ahead pa pa pi pi u u pr pr pe pai po pau pam pa ha pa pa pi pi pu pu pr pr pe pai po po pau pam pa ha a pam pa ha pa ha pa ha pa ha pa ha you are saying pa ha it's not pa ha pa ha pa ha pa ha ha 
फॉर फ इट इज विसर्ग फू से दिस वर्ड हा सो मेन्टेन फ एंड देन गिव विसर्ग फू आर सेंग फी वॉन्ट दिस साउंड वेरी गुड फ पम सॉरी यू आर सेंग एवरीथिंग बट नॉट दिस यू आर सेंग पहा यू आर सेंग बहा बट यू आर नॉट सेंग बहा भहा इट्स बी एच ए राइट मैडम करेक्ट येस पहा ओके no the first one was better okay go ahead with this ma ma mi mi mu mu mr mr me mai mo mau mam maha yeah so the mahaprana uh visargas you just be mindful ha huh? not yet ready so okay now let's go and complete today before the time is up and uh, then we see first everything you've done good ha ha ba ha has to come okay let's go for the avargya sounds now y y ya ha so now what happens is many don't know to chant this is e sound okay e to y will become y y many chant e but we need y so this sound is y and not e y y y you you Ryu, Ryu, Ye, Yai, Yo, Yau, Yam, Yaha. All pretty easy, except when to say that Ye, Ye. That sound has to come correct. Ye, then we have R, R. रा री री हा सी नाउ वॉट हैपन्स रू विल नॉट गो डाउन रू विल गो बिहाइंड अवे यू पुट उकारा देर एंड यू डोंट पुट रुकारा देर ओके दिस इज नॉट दिस इज नॉट करेक्ट रूज उकारा इज बिहाइंड रू ऑन द बॉडी एंड नॉट एट द टेल 
then see the ru over here this is like this so the ru small ru is like this or you can have even the not and you can do this and the long ru is like this one is curving in one is going out this can be with or without not doesn't make a difference but it is in coming and that is out going there the not has to be there so that is our ru ru please remember all this this sound is not there for this one so we don't have that sound re re ro ro ram raha ya r then we have l l la li li lu lu ru ru me lai lo lau lam la ha Two minutes for you to finish writing. <coughs> Hari, on the r sound in this l would be how? L, ha. Huh. It's a little dicey. It's almost the same kind of a sound you will get. L, l, l. The l, ha, l. L R U, and L R U O R. Just give me a minute. Okay, we go for the. Here are the v, v, v. V, 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 we have time it's because next class is here and we have the sibilants and also the aspirant h i'm erasing this you all can simultaneously start your love sh sh s h these four we have to do now it is pretty straight you all can continue doing it if you all are knowing it we have sh to go sh to go s to go h to go sh 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 she shu shu 
Shiru. Shiru. I think we can do only one. The rest I'll give you as a homework. She. Shai. Show. Show. Sham. Shah. Three you can take as a homework. Hmm. For her, just remember this sound will come in the belly. Rest, everything else should be fine. Okay? So, her we write as usual. This sound, huh? we are talking about this one. This you take it in. That's all. And you write her as usual. And in the belly you give two. Rest, I think, should be okay. We'll stop over here so that you get some homework. And you can do for the conjuncts also and come as a homework because these are only three, right? Conjuncts we have. Now leave aside the conjunct, it's confusing. We'll take conjuncts sometime later. Okay, any questions so far? So the homework is for these three alphabets. Everything is same except for her. For these two, we have a different way to do it. Who and all will come below only? Who, who will go below only? Um, okay. Ma'am, do we need to record anything? Yes. When you will do this homework, the same homework you would do in the recording. You can... Start from sh itself so that you know the difference. Sh, sh, s, h. So for recording, these four will be there. And for writing, I can check also how you have written because there will be some mistake in this probably. So I can check that also. There can be a mistake over here. You can see. Okay. So let's end the session because I have none starting next in 5.30. So keep your spine straight. Close your eyes. Take a deep breath in and exhale. Take a deep breath in and exhale. Take a deep breath in. Hold it there. Om. Oh, 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 Purnamada, Purnamidam, Purna, Purna Mudachate, Purnasya, Purnamadaya, Purnameva, Vashishate, Om, Sham, Tisham, Tisham, Tihi. Hari Hiyo, Shri Guru Pyo Namaha, Hari Hiyo, Shri Krishna Arpana Mastu. Hari Om everyone, see you all next week. Hari Om. Hari Om, thank you ma'am. Hari Om Guruji. Thank you. Hari Om. Hari Om, thank you. Hari Om Varshaji, thank you so much. Thank you, Hari Om. Thank you, Gabriela. Happy Ramadan.